to River City Live. One of the biggest trending topics right now is airplane travel. Obviously, what happened with United, but also, too, it's springtime, it's summertime, people are traveling. So how do you act properly on a plane? Well, we brought back our etiquette expert, Kesa Mineta, to walk us through what we should be doing. And really, everybody benefits if everybody is behaving properly, absolutely, correct? Absolutely, absolutely. And really, the whole premise of good manners is being respectful and kind. And if we just remember those things when we're traveling, traveling's not fun like it used to be. It's really kind of a utility. And it's, I'd say it's not an uh, individual sport anymore. It's a team sport. So we got to all work together. It is. To it's to mass it. transit right yeah, now. There's absolutely. a lot of people and you kind of feel like cattle, yeah, you know, going times. through all the different gates and the lines and stuff yeah, like that. Yeah. So where can we start with this? I think to start, the one thing we want to do is we want to make sure that we're not stressed out when we get to the airport. Make sure you've got plenty of time. I always say, figure out how much time you've got and add 45 minutes to an hour because it's going to take you longer than you think. Something's always going to happen. Your plane's going to be delayed or there's trouble boarding or there's trouble with your ticket or something like that. So you, you want to make sure that you're early and you have plenty of time so that when you get through TSA and get to your gate, you're kind of going, this is okay. Yeah, I, I agree with that moment. totally because when you are early, you're not stressed. Exactly. So you are going to be on your best behavior. And right now with a lot of airports, there are places to snack, there are places to lounge, so get there early and relax. Try to make it as enjoyable as you possibly can. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. so that, that's a great tip. All right, so what's next on the list then? Well, you mentioned snacks, and if you've got time to grab something to eat before you go on the plane, do that. If you have to have something to eat, if you feel like the plane's going to be two or three hours, grab some energy bars or some peanuts or a candy bar or whatever. Don't take smelly food on an airplane. I mean, that is really offensive to everybody on the plane. <laughs> Plus, then you've got to sit there and watch somebody eat. Yes. You know, yeah. which is also kind of... Well, and when you're on a plane too, it's a, a cabin that's enclosed, right? Exactly. So there's not a lot of air circulating around. Right. Now, if you bring on that Cinnabon, I'm a fan. I'm your buddy. Well, now that might be okay. Yeah. Right? But if you bring on anything else, it really is. It's smelly. And like you said, you don't really have a lot of space right. really to eat. Right. You know, right. so like that, that could be a problem. Right. All right so what else is on the list? Because again, there's a lot of things yeah. here. Well, you, I think that you always want to dress appropriately. And there's a couple of things there. Um, first of all, Think about what you've got to go through TSA, sure. so don't wear big boots that have to come off or lace-up shoes or, you know, three jackets or whatever. So be thinking about that when you're preparing for your trip. Um, and then when you get on the plane, again, you want to make sure that you're just kind of taking your seat and get your bag up above and just kind of doing everything in a timely manner. Think about what you've got to put up in the top uh, of an airplane before you get there. You know, sure. don't make it too heavy because you want to be you you want to be timely because if you're timely then you can save time for the person behind you and all of that so we're really just kind of thinking about the whole team yeah um if you're sitting on the airplane if you get the middle seat what do you, what do you do if you're in the middle seat what happens to the armrest right so you have one on each side if you're in the middle right do you have access to both do you, you get, get to claim both those? of them that, wow. that, that is that is modern etiquette is that if you're in the middle seat you get both armrest and you better take them because that's a that's really not a very pleasant place to be. <laughs> no, it's not. Yeah. And I guess the people on the other sides, they could kind of lean a little bit so they have that to, you know, to yeah, their advantage. Exactly. So, if you're in the exactly. middle, claim those armrests. Right, those right. are great tips. And I know the last one you were talking about earlier, you were saying be nice. Be nice. That's a big part of it, exactly. right? Exactly. Yeah. Um, I ask flight attendants a lot of the time when I get off the plane, what is, what is the one thing, one piece of advice that you would give to people? And they say, just be nice. If you're nice, everything goes a lot better. That is know? totally true. Well, Kay, thanks again for all these tips. To learn more about Kay and Manners for Life, you go to our website, rivercitylivetv.com.